the Senate Judiciary Committee has the jurisdictional responsibility to look at the issue of antitrust and competition. This is an example of it, and I'm glad we're having this hearing today. If you want to have real business practices and the strength of the free market system, you need competition. And when you have a monopoly circumstance, uh, it lessens competition, raises prices, and diminishes the uh, development of the company. What happened here? Taylor Swift announced a concert tour, and the technology of Ticketmaster completely blew up over that announcement. So to suggest that we have a good system today uh, really ignores that reality. What we're doing here is having a public hearing because the public has a right to know exactly what is going on. And um, we also have the ability to have these witnesses be sworn in under oath, uh, which is helpful because there's a lot of reports that the Justice Department is conducting an investigation right now. This is evidence for the Justice Department to use. And then finally, the members get educated. And it is time to put forward new legislation, especially when it comes to fees and transparency on these tickets. There's a government accountability report that shows that 27% of the ticket price is fees. And there's some of the tickets have been shown to be up to 75% fees. That's outrageous. And that's what happens when you have one entity, which is Ticketmaster Live Nation, that has 70% of the big ticket market that has the promotion, which is Live Nation, and then also owns a bunch of the venues. And for the venues they don't own, they get three to five to seven years in terms of exclusive deals, cutting out other competitors that you're going to hear from today at the hearing. We are seeing more consolidation across the board. 75% of American industries are getting more consolidated. What's different is finally, at the end of the year, Congress did one thing. Uh, we voted for more funding for the agencies in terms of making the merging companies pay, and that's going to give our enforcers the ability to take on the biggest companies the world has ever known, not with Band-Aid and duct tapes, but actually being able to do a very big effort to take on companies, whether it is in tech or whether it is in ticketing, because these are monopolies, and you just can't do it uh, with the shadow of agencies that we've been seeing the last few years. So that merger fee change we made that Senator Grassley and I got through, that's $100 million a year for the agencies, and so that's the beginning. I believe in capitalism, and you can't have capitalism when a major company screws up a major concert and there's no one else to go to. That's, what's weird. that's the status of competition right now in the ticket market. Whether it is Harry Styles or Bad Bunny, um, we have had many bands, Bruce Springsteen, uh, we had way back uh, Pearl Jam trying to push this issue. So there have been bands and artists that have been pushing it forever, but we welcome the Taylor Swift fans to our forces.